morning vlog welcome back to the classroom it has been a hot minute since i have vlogged a day in the life here in spain teaching at an american school as you guys i mean if you watch my other videos i'll link one here my previous one how i've been struggling so much at work um but things have gotten so much better i feel like i'm getting my teacher personality back and this week is the last week before spring break so today is thursday i just saw someone trying to come into my classroom and i'm gonna set up my class we're gonna have a chill day i have like three kids not coming today because this next week is semana santa and it's like the big like spring easter celebration in madrid i mean in spain and so a lot of kids are starting their vacaciones very early so we're gonna be chilling today i want to do some organizing i've been trying to do more data entry get myself all situated and organized. Yes, I feel like I have lots of updates. First, I wanna set up my classroom. Also, today's theme, well, okay, Monday, I'll put a picture, it was crazy hair day. Tuesday, what was Tuesday? How am I already forgetting? I've been here this whole week. Oh, Tuesday, we celebrated St. Patrick's Day, so it was like all green. Wednesday was yesterday, monochrome day. Today's crazy sock day. I don't have crazy socks on yet, I have a friend bringing me some crazy socks and I also think I'm gonna like stick some random socks to my legs so I think that will be fun and cute and anyways yeah so I don't know I don't even I feel like I've been so out of the vlogging that I don't even know what to tell you guys about my life okay I guess basically I just need to set up my classroom I feel like this week has been pretty chill we did do testing for their reading levels that's what I've been doing during my like center time when usually we do like small group reading interventions things have been much better behavior wise in my classroom i have learned to be way more strict with the students you know just like not let things slide and i feel like this part of the year like no one tells you as a teacher that once you get to like february i feel like is that sweet spot of where like the kids get so comfortable and like they just feel like they rule the school they own the school like they don't really care if <laughs> you give them consequences and like stuff like that and so it's just i mean it's also my second year teaching so i'm still like getting in the groove of everything the weather in madrid has been beautiful it's like gonna be up to like 75 degrees today that will not last long though next week it's gonna be like cold again oh semana santa i'm so excited for semana santa because Friday we get out of school early, so I am headed to London to meet up with some of my friends from the US. We're like meeting up in a spot in London. And I'm gonna be there until Sunday, it's a quick trip. And then Tuesday, my other friend from the States who actually lives in Spain, she lives in like the South, she's coming up by train and we're gonna hang out in Madrid on Tuesday. And then Wednesday to Sunday, Wednesday we're going to Amsterdam. So that's gonna be super fun. Like. These are just the benefits of living in Europe and being able to like travel to all these cool places. Anyways, I'm gonna get set up. I'm gonna do some work and I'll probably talk to you guys during their first planning period. I don't know though. So we have a new teacher at the school because my partner teacher, she went on maternity leave. And so we have a new teacher. So I've been helping her out with stuff. So I might have to help her with some things during the first planning period. But if not, I will talk to you guys, take you guys through the day and just get back in the vlogging mode producing more content for all the people all of you guys anyways let's get into the day okay time to figure out what socks to wear let's see fun enough okay this is the final look i hope it's crazy enough i think the kids will laugh it's fun okay so it turns out that our pe teacher did not show up this morning um so i ended up being with the kids a lot longer than I was supposed to initially, but it was fine. We got some like extra work done. I have three kids missing today and we're just like very chill these last couple days before break. Um, but right now I'm working on planning for the week after spring break. This is the calendar, calendar, the planner that I use. I used one of these last year as well. It's Happy Planner and it's like humongous. It's basically set up so that you can like just plan every day. So I have like phonics, reading, math, science, art, religion, social studies, homework, and reminders. So I'm getting all of that organized. I usually make the newsletters on Canva. These are just like, it's like our April newsletter, important reminders, birthdays, and what we're learning this month. Both teachers, like 
there's 2k3 classes which is kindergarten in Spain um, well at the school that I'm at and both of us send out like the same newsletters so that everything is like consistent and all the same for the teachers but I am trying to get organized this is my first planning of the day the kids are at recess right now it's currently 11 21 um, the kids loved my socks it was a big hit we took like a cute picture with our socks which I want to post on my Instagram so I'm gonna do that and yeah I'm gonna keep working keep typing and I'll talk to you guys later I had lunch I've been working a little bit while my kids have been at music and what I'm working on now is like so tedious and it's taking so long but I think it'll be worth it in the end we have portfolios that we make for all the kids and we want to make them look nice obviously for like the end of the year and so I'm currently like any worksheet like if it's something like a worksheet that I've saved for the portfolio I'm cutting and gluing it onto a piece of cards what is this called cartulina in Spanish whatever this is called the like thick nice paper I'm gluing it onto there and putting it in their like file organizers which are down here so that's probably what I'm gonna spend this planning period doing and I'm waiting to find out if the PE teacher is gonna take them for recess since they didn't have it for recess for PE because they didn't have it this morning but I'm gonna sit here and continue cutting and gluing my days away here we go Okay, it is the end of the day. I am closing out for the day. It is currently 4.45. This is the state of my classroom. It's pretty clean, not too bad. Tomorrow's Friday. I'm so excited because we're just gonna do chill things. We're gonna do a fun Friday in the morning. We get out early from school. So basically, I'm not gonna do much teaching tomorrow. We're just gonna hang out and chill with the remaining children that show up to school tomorrow. Um, but yes, it is time to go. I'm gonna run to the restroom and get all my things and get going.